Oh, right everyone, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Uh, this is going to be the first of <clears throat> possibly a series of, of you know, back-end style videos showing you guys a few stats, a few analytics from my YouTube channel. Now one of the questions I get asked a lot is how much money does YouTube give you? How much money do you earn through YouTube? How much, how much revenue do you get? And um, well, it varies greatly. Um, you know, one thing can happen as soon as you upload a video, if your video has copyrighted content in it, it gets flagged and you don't get any revenue. That happens on basically every single one of my reaction videos, unless I do it to videos on a channel that is clearly monetized, such as Joseph Vincent, such as KTO, such as, you know, Highlight Heaven, I believe, things like that. If I'm going for channels like NFL, NFL Films, NHL, NCAA, things like that, nah, ain't gonna work. I'm not gonna get anything. Now, today's video, we're going to focus on one, one video. It is my most viewed video. It has over 1.6 million views. And it's not monetized, but it was. Now, the reason I want to make this video is because I've seen a whole lot of other people make videos about their, their most viewed videos, their 1 million view videos, 10 million view videos, how much money you get. People love talking about money. People love figures, facts and figures. And you know what? With... The way that my channel goes, the, the way that I create videos, I, I don't like, I don't like too many smoke and mirrors, you know, I like telling the truth and um, that's what you're always going to get through this channel. So that's what we're going to do. Now I've talked about in the past copyright claims, I've talked about how they work, I've talked about how they, they take your revenue and what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to show you guys on the back end which of my top 10 most viewed videos, which is probably accounting for about 7 or 8 million views, probably about well, probably about six or seven million views, but um, well, I'm going to show you guys which ones are eligible for, for revenue, which ones aren't. Then we're going to pick out the top one of the list, which has a total of 1.57 million views. Rugby player reacts to NFL football's most savage moments. Fantastic video, one of my first, but unfortunately one of my least uh, paying. But I did get some, and that's why I'm making this video. In the early days, when I put up a video, the NFL obviously didn't know about me. I don't know. I don't know what's happened, but basically, for the first like three or four months that I put up reaction videos to the NFL, they weren't getting flagged. And then, lo and behold, every day I might get a couple more, and a couple more would get flagged, and a couple more would get flagged. And then, lo and behold, you know, basically they were getting flagged as soon as I uploaded them. So I don't know whether the NFL on the back end had more staff looking for these copyright claims, or whether you know some sort of algorithm change happened. But what happened with this particular video, I got it monetized for probably the first two or three months, and then just like that, it was cut off. So I'm gonna show you guys exactly when that happened. I'm gonna show you guys how much I may have missed out on um, due to the views coming after that point, and uh, let's get into it. So here we are on the back end of the channel. You're most likely never gonna see this again in your life unless I've got another million viewed video, which I tend to think that's probably never gonna happen due to uh, the views on my channel falling off a cliff uh, about a year ago but uh, you know we press on and I'm not going to give up so with that being said here are the top one two three four five six seven eight nine ten videos on my channel okay by views we've counted it by views if I go like that it's going to go to the bottom those are videos I haven't put out yet <laughs> by the way um, and if I click it again it goes to the top so top video fifth 1.57 million views the second one 779,000 third 648,000 639,000 489,000 462,000 451,000 430,000 414,000 and 372,000 let's have a look at monetization top one rugby player reacts to NFL football's most savage moments 1.57 million views and it's not eligible for monetization because of a copyright claim which is fine the second one rugby player reacts to nhl hockey's biggest hits of all time now this video is an anomaly this is an absolute anomaly this never happens but i have a video at this point that has nearly 800,000 views and monetization is still on so really i should probably show you how much i've earned from that video but I'm not going to, I'm going to keep that a secret. Third on the list, rugby player reacts to Marshall and Lynch beast mode. Now this video, now this video, this, this one is extremely important to the success of my YouTube channel over the past 18 months. This video was the one that popped. This is the one 
that honestly it got to about 500,000 views within three days now that is crazy and I was sitting at home with 10,000 subs grinding away for the last five years and I saw that video do that that was a feeling oh you know I, I can't even explain I was on adrenaline I, I didn't even need to I didn't need to sleep for days I was like what is happening with my channel this is it you know I've been waiting so long I've been waiting years for this to happen and it finally happened and the only reason it happened is because I put the work in to make the videos now that video unfortunately no money fourth on the list rugby player reacts to NFL biggest football hits ever this one it says I'm getting revenue um, but it's you know it's it's a small fraction of what I should be getting and the reason that this one's claimed is because of the music that I used in the intro and that's one thing I got caught out big time with I probably made about 200 reaction videos with the song all the way up by Fat Joe at the start fantastic song I used it on my channel for years um, never got caught with it because it was a, a, a clip that was under 10 seconds long and lo and behold uh, a few of my videos start getting claimed and a few more get claimed and a few more get claimed and basically it's because these copyright claim owner these copyright owners the, the artist or the, the management company of the artist wait till your video gets maybe 10 20 thousand views and then it hits claim because videos under 10 or 20 thousand views are pretty much obsolete they don't earn fuck all and so basically what was happening is that any of my reaction videos that got anywhere near you know 50 or 100 thousand views were getting claimed and it was because of the music and unfortunately I couldn't go back in and change the music so those videos you know I had no I mean basically I had to be happy with whatever revenue I earned before the copyright claim came in and that's exactly what happened with the NFL football's most savage moments video and that's what we're going to cover anyways number five this is a different story altogether this is blocked okay rugby player reacts to Barry Sanders NFL career highlights YouTube video nearly 500,000 views and it's blocked and it's only got blocked very recently and I'm fucking pissed off about it but one thing I have mentioned in the past is that when I tried to dispute a blocked video the NFL has a choice whether to ignore my dispute or take down the video and recently that's happened with one of my full-length match reactions to the Jaguars it got taken down and I was issued with a copyright strike if you get three copyright strikes within three months your channel is terminated and I've got one currently effectively what could happen is I could go and dispute that blocked video try and get it unblocked it backfire on me and then I could have two copyright strikes so for now I'm just leaving it but it's a video with 500,000 views over 3,000 comments nearly three you know nearly 4,000 likes and it's blocked for what reason why is the NFL blocking that video? Why can't they just be happy with the revenue that they make? I don't know. Anyways, it's an algorithm thing. Honestly, you can't explain it. Number six on the list. Rugby player reacts to Ray Lewis, the greatest NFL career feature film. Now, this video went crazy. This video has probably, probably got me, you know, the better part of maybe 5,000 subscribers just from this video. It was one of my earlier ones. Um, one of my most genuine reactions because it was very, very early in the piece and um, it was my first look at Ray Lewis and you know back then I didn't know how legendary Ray Lewis was but clearly he is now with that video it's once again ineligible so I don't earn anything from it but thank God it's public number seven on the list Troy Polamalu um, once again blocked uh, once again after nearly 500,000 views over 2,000 comments and you know nearly 5,000 likes that video deserves to be out there for people to watch but it's not and I can't do fuck all about it. Number eight in the list. Here is where it changes. This is a piece of content that is solely mine. It is me, it is no one else, I'm not using any music, nothing. And those are the videos that you've got no worries about people claiming your content, nothing like that. You reap the rewards of your content and that's that. And that's the kind of content that I started on my channel with. Now these reaction videos brought in a whole whole different type of video but it also brought in these these copyright claims that I never had to deal with before and this video is an example of that how to sidestep like the pros 430,000 views 400 comments four and a half thousand likes and I have kept 
all of the revenue. I believe it's probably around $500. Um, and for 430,000 views, $500 is probably a decent amount. But unfortunately that is, you know, and I have to admit that's the only video that I've created solely myself in my top 10 um, most viewed videos. So eh, it is what it is. I've never used YouTube for revenue. I've never thought of it as a full-time job, although I would love to do YouTube as a full-time job one day. But I think for that to happen, I'm gonna have to increase um, my uh, memberships on the channel. Uh, which you can do for a certain price per month you can support the channel or I'm gonna have to increase my patreon um, membership because you know with ad revenue as you can see uh, you know if I was keeping all this revenue from my my top view videos maybe things would be different but I'm not so anyway at number nine we've got rugby player reacts to Saquon Barkley top 10 plays of PSU and uh, you know this video has probably brought me in about 3,000 subs but no money unfortunately 414,000 views, nearly 3,000 likes, uh, 3,000 comments, nearly 6,000 likes, and I don't earn anything from it. It's fuck, it's it's heartbreaking. And then we've got number 10, rugby player reacts to JJ Watt, NFL career highlights, and it's ineligible for monetization because of a copyright claim, which is fine. I use the NFL's content, and uh, we've got 3,000 comments, 5,000 likes, <sighs> but no money. It's a travesty. Anyways, let's get into the top view video. This is what this, this video is about. How much, how much, how much really did YouTube pay me for my most viewed video? 1.5 million views. We're about to find out, let's do it. Ah, so as you can see on the back end, this is what I see. I'll show you this once and for all. Uh, we've got the title, we've got the description, We've got the thumbnail, we've got the tags. Over here we have a little preview of the video. We've got the visibility, it's public. We've got playlists that it's in. Cards, which is those little annotation screens that come up the top suggesting other videos, which I never use. And an end screen, which comes in in the last 20 seconds to uh, give you an opportunity to subscribe or watch another video. So that's what you see on the back end. And if we go to analytics, this is what you see here. So this is for the last 28 days, we've got nearly 7,000 views, it's gained me 15 subscribers, which is, you know, pittance, uh, and no revenue. So let's take it back to since uploaded, so the lifetime of the video. And there we have it. The video came out on the 9th of August, believe it or not. We had 11,342 views in the first day. From there it went down to 1800 on the second day and then it started popping off. And it probably took about a week and a half for it to really hit its peak. That was on Tuesday, August 21st, where it had nearly 100,000 views that day. From there, we had a day of 50,000, 40,000, 60,000, then it popped off again to 83,000. And from there it sort of tapered off, went down for another week, halfway through September, it went off again, averaging about 40,000 views per day. And since then, you know, it's, it's, it's had one, one particular, you know, good period uh, at the start of December last year, where it was averaging probably 5,000 views a day. And since then, for this whole entire year, it's probably averaged, you know, probably a few hundred to maybe 500 a day. But unfortunately, I've earned nothing. Now, that's the views, okay? So look at that graph, take a good look at it, and then we're gonna go over to your estimated revenue. Now, as you can see, this whole entire video, 1.6 million views, netted me a total of $745.50. I'm, I'm not even sure if I'm allowed to show that, but I'm going to. There's gonna be no pixels or there's gonna be no blurred out sections of this, this, this video, okay? You're seeing exactly what it is, exactly what I see, and exactly how much I got paid. And that's what this video is about. That's what this channel is about. $745.50 from 1.6 million views. The most important thing about this video is the amount of subscribers I gained, which was 5.4 thousand. Five and a half thousand subs from one video. That's amazing. Okay, so we got here. 1.6 million views. As you can see, the, the peak was on August the 21st, 2018. The second peak was a week later on August the 26th, 2018. And if we look over here, we click on the revenue, 
we're going to see exactly when the claim was created and when the revenue was cut off. So let's do that now. There. There we go. August the 26th, the second peak of the video, we earned $84 on that day from how many thousand views? From 83,000 views. So basically, basically a dollar per thousand views. If we go back over here, the, set, the first peak was on August the 21st, which as we can see here, we got 96,000 views and we received a total of $80. So throughout the time that this video actually earned me money, it was probably tracking along at about a dollar per thousand views. So what that tells me is that if I did keep all of the revenue from this video throughout the whole entire time, I'd most likely have made, you know, about $1,600, $1,500, $1,600. What I did make was 745. So as you can see, 26th of August, $84. Uh, what do we got here? Can we zoom in here a bit? Oh shit, not like that. So as you can see, August 26th, $84.46. August 27th, $33.24. And August 28th, we got a total of three cents. And from August 29th, 2018 on, we received nothing. Wow, yeah, swear to God I'm with it. I don't see nobody in my lane is quite go get it like me. Wow, please don't be wasting my time with that business. Who are you kidding, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been up and working to the morning, yeah. The morning. Yeah, they been sleeping now. I swear they storming, yeah. They storming. Yeah, and I swear I'm cooking like a foreman, like foreman. Uh, and my foreman jumping like it's Jordan like on my it's way. Broom, broom, tell him I'm my lane. I've been praying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta say this thing, I'm the same. 